Forgiveness is such a countercultural thing to do. All too often, sorry seems to be the hardest word. At St Augustine's School in Taunton, students have been learning about forgiveness and reconciliation in a very practical way. From time to time, students, staff and parents find themselves either victims or perpetrators of some act of wrongdoing. The school, with the help of Liz Lewis, the chaplain, and Andy Jenrick from the Avon and Somerset Police, have begun a restorative justice program. This tries to look at the way in which people can care for each other and deal with a problem in another way other than punishment. So how do you find discipline in this school? Like any school, there's lots of occasions when discipline has to be used. Sometimes it works very well, sometimes there are slight problems afterwards, but it is something that's part of daily life in any school. So Liz, what is this restorative justice? Restorative justice is a means whereby people who have had a disagreement or a fallout with each other can actually come together and put things right with each other. Um, it's not a, a system whereby you force somebody to say sorry or to ask somebody for forgiveness, but it's a way in which people can see each other's viewpoints, can understand each other's hurts and pain, and then can come back together to renew friendships and relationships.